your secrets if you really look at yourself you will be speechless what happened to being doctors and teachers what happened to being your brother's keeper nowadays kids more worried about the Portsmouth yeah that chorus from the crowd screaming Potato! Welcome guys back to another Let's Play The Walking Dead. I'm sorry that I didn't upload yesterday on Monday because it was my birthday and I was doing a lot of stuff. I ended up going on uh, a Pokemon hunt after a few drinks late at night because I'm getting really addicted to that game. But it was my birthday yesterday so there's going to be two uploads out today. There's going to be a Walking Dead and Limbo so they're definitely coming out. And this thing that my brother got me was pretty sick. And also, sorry about the audio if it sounds a bit weird because I've got my fan on because it's fucking hot in this room. But, holy shit, that was close. I got a little, uh, Chucky fucking pop movie doll. It's pretty cool. But yeah, I'm getting really into uh, Pokemon at the minute. It's so addictive to me, I think, because it's just all real Pokemon. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah. I've got my uh, energy drink today to get me through today, so I'm gonna go record this and Limbo. Just def definitely get it out. But Pokemon, it's it's taken over everyone's lives. It's fucking, uh, it's just a, it's just a mental at the minute. I think my highest Pokemon at the minute is a five eight nine Pinsa. As you can see there. Yeah, it's a pretty fucking strong Pokemon. Just got a message. But uh, yeah, I'm loving the, the Pokemon game at the minute, it's so addictive. Let me know what you guys are doing on it, like, I think I've just gone Team Mystic, Team Blue. Woo! But yeah, but, um, the only reason I'm starting to do a shout out on that is because only one person asked for a shout out. But I want to try and get, from now on, I'm, if, even if people don't ask for shout outs, I'm going to shout people out who I've been watching, so... That's the way it's going to be. And also GTA 5 won the vote, I think, on Twitter. Just let me have a quick, quick look-see. Because I put a vote up on Twitter and asked you guys to vote on it. It was GTA, Star Wars and... What else was there? I can't remember the other one. GTA, Star Wars and Among the Sleep. And as you guys can see there. If you can see it. GTA has clearly fucking won it. So a GTA 5 story mode is going to be coming out on Friday because Outlast finished. I think it's Friday, so I'm bringing it out. I ain't too sure, but there are GTA videos coming out soon. But yeah, let's just get into this. I've been rambling on for a bit. But if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you smash that like button. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. Or if you've been around and you haven't subscribed yet, Subscribe and join the time and army today and share it about with your friends and get them to join as well. But yeah, let's just get into it and also like I said if you want to shout out for shouts and that make sure you comment your channel name down below. And let's just get into this. It is fucking hot today man. It's ridiculous. It was hot yesterday as well. It was fucking boiling. Why can't I hear nothing from my headset? What is that always turned all the way up for? That's no good. That is too fucking loud. That's getting turned down. Jesus. I'm not playing out last. No need to have it that loud, Darren. Yeah, but uh, last time, if. Uh, okay, just some random fucking energy bar. Dick. Uh, we gave Clementine and Duck an uh, energy bar because this twat who was on the floor just was trying to kill Duck. Because he thought he was, he'd been bit. And we, we don't do that. You don't kill kids, man. Come on. I can see where my fucking microphone was in. Well, it was a good birthday. I had a few points down the pub with my brother. It's nothing better than having to chill that point. And it's chilled out with a few mates late at night. Just going on a Pokemon hunt. Just collecting Pokemons. It's a stick. It's a stick, mate. <laughs> Pick it up. Pick it up and then I'll turn the position that camera on. This is my dad's cane. He 
zip around here on from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplift his way. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you didn't have. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. His dad's a sick. Did he used to beat you with that walking stick? Better get this door clear, huh? Can I what help? Door? Oh, the desk. Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Oh, near the drawers. <clears throat> Things are getting scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. Oh, I don't know so why hot. everyone is crazy. Neither do I for the time. Because that's Nobody sick. Does, I, don't think. I bet my dad does. What, is your dad so smart? Oh, here we go. <sighs> it looks like he's not even trying to. Do you have kids? No. No. You don't have oh, a family? Didn't know. Is a doctor and my dad is a conversation. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing, things like that. Like um, social studies? Yeah, like that. Spot you kid. didn't answer my question. All right, learn further. Uh. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Yes. Because they're dead. <laughs> and it's all your fault. I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things were a bit different. Yeah. <laughs> you mean, bitch. <laughs> I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me oh. when I get in trouble. I can relate. It's really hot in here, man. It is really annoying. Fucking heat waves, much. Ha <laughs> ha. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it? Hit <laughs> my finger. A little. I'll find you a bandage. Oh, look at that. Just a random first aid box sitting there. Surprise. Surprise. Is it a bit... So there he goes, just pulling my fucking... Trouser legs up, man. Fuck, it's just so hot. I just don't know why. Why? Let's have a look at that why? Thing. Oh. Well, I'm loving this game. Let's <laughs> see if we can do something about it. I'm trying to play a lot of Telltale games, so it's probably on this channel. But after this one, it Let's could be all... Yes, please. Game of Thrones, Telltales, Telltales, fucking Borderlands. Ugh. Oh, I tasted like garlic. Lee? Yeah. Yes? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me. Okay. Oh, fan is doing nothing. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. What do we need to help Larry? Larry's a dick. Oh, his photo. Uh oh. Find anything? <gasps> oh shit, she just saw me rip that up. <laughs> just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. You're Lee uh -oh. Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. 
This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that truck. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? The world has ended out there. I didn't know what to say then, I've got fucking blurred out. If you don't think people find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I don't want to fuck with her, she's the one with I'll just keep it to myself. Thank you. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Carly. But that Glemton stood that for fuck's sake. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah. Uh, uh, You're not bad, right? I uh what are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Yeah. Yeah, he was. And you had to protect yourself. That's right. You can't oh, get... Because okay. she's a kid, you can't turn her on. You can't... Someone slept with my wife and I fucked him over. By well, killing him, not actually fucking him. If you know what I mean. Wait. So, the shit that I done, didn't count. So, all those energy bars that I picked up, I didn't give anyone. Well, there should be another energy bar then, because there was three. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, huh? Hey, well, that's fine. Uh, this oh, is Glenn, Glenn. and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone or on the talkie or whatever? This is what's Glenn always getting to shit. So I'm down at that motor inn and well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm not here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped out at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? Uh, awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of him. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. Doug. I'll take Carly and her dad My name's down to the motor and get Glenn and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. A jog? You're fucking skinny. You don't need a flipping jog. Yeah, there's three. So I'll give one to Duck, one to the kid, and then one to Carly because I'm not sorry. It's not much, but here for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. Well, look at him. I could tell he needs some sweet. His no, ears could take up the whole fucking... The one was eaten by the living dead guards. Well, that could be a game. I could actually want a football game. It's not much, but here we go. Thank you. Of course. It's an energy bar as well. That's like a boost. Boosts are all over there. Oh, fuck the best. Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. But I'm trying to keep her fed and water. You're a good caretaker. Yay. <laughs> Yo, Doug. Ever seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the suicidal. The suicidal. suicidal. When I say so, it's over. So cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Agreed, sir. Agreed. 
I'm stepping outside, man. You must be crazy. I just love how it's comic book style. <laughs> just eat. As far as I can tell, myself, I care. Because it's the only bit of the brain that's working. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. That guy over there has the keys. It's his brother. Sure. I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. It's a brick. It would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, that's all I know. I'm sure... Oh, I didn't check that shop properly, did I? I'm gonna have to go back in. Okay. I won't go back in. Check that drugstore a bit more. Because we can't open that lock and I can't pick up that boy. Green cards, pins, photographs. Oh, not coin in pain now, are you, Larry, you bitch? It's a bit harsh. Hey! TV. That's what I figured. Nothing. Nothing on the TV at all. Hello. Cause I can't even watch the news. Who watches the news anymore? I don't. Is there any point in following me in there? No. No, there wasn't. This when they say it's over. Every time I look at it, it makes me laugh. You're a pretty good more shot. Can I say? Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three I'll days out from the last Pretty good looking bird. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. How? Well, why are they coming now? Oh, there's a door. I knew that. What an ugly person. Is that why I walk when I'm Did drunk? <laughs> sure it's just eating people. Guys. Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. Glenn, you dick. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trap up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner of the room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. Who's Glenn? Oh, my, it's gotta oh, be the hero. 
I was trying to get him to help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bit. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. I can't just leave her. Stay right in camp. You guys are suicidal. Yes, Let we can. Go. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. I don't care. No, the only damsel in distress for Glenn is Maggie. That zombie's just chilling. That one's just eating. Okay, this is the plan. You don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's more to that. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly, always attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Let's go to the dilly old jeep. Jeep. Don't you touch your feet. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. How the fuck am I meant to smash it? We can do something with that car, I bet. We can work for that fella looking near the front. I can't do nothing looking, it's fuck. Yeah, I'm moving, boy. What the fuck? So if I push up, it will just go there. I push right, he goes there. Why not just have one fucking button? Seriously, man, you're really pissing me off right now. I want to move back. There we go. Stay in your zombie. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I have a weapon. What the fuck am I meant to do? I've checked everywhere. It's bullshit. Hello. That's not really what I have in mind. Hey. Oh, she's got a gun and she can shoot the car window out using the pillow. Up in the pickup truck. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Oh, we use the pillow on it. Was sick. <laughs> that was actually pretty cool. I call that the pillow sack. Spark plug. 
you should hold on. Come on. Oh, the zombies just saw it. Hello. That was awesome. Was that? I'll go to the look, it's just like, oh, I know what you're doing, it's just like, no you don't. Just, just keep away from me. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. What's that inside these things? Turns cold windows to tissue paper. That's pretty cool though. Shit inside the spark plug or I can weird. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. I'm gonna scramble some zombie's brain all over this pavement. Let's go to the zoo. The zoo. The zoo. Everyone's back, cleanse a beast. Ow. Dude, where'd your weapon go? <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Axe murderer style. Two more. I'm going to chop up That's some helpful. bitches. Cause I'm no, gonna chop up some zombies, I'm gonna chop off okay. their heads. We'll see right behind you. And I might end up hitting ya. Don't be actually like right behind me, cause there is a spiky thing on the end of this axe. A cool teller. What a wonderful face. Radical, extreme. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. She's in trouble. Miss, we're coming in. She's bit. Bet you hurt. Oh god. I I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die, and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Lynn. I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please. Uh. Just leave me. Please go. Okay. We'll leave. Just 
Try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me? I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please! I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Sad choice. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Yes. Look at her, Carly. There's no happy ending to this. Okay. Fine. You're not just gonna hand it to her, now you're gonna so make her pick it up. You're I a fucking bitch. This must be. You can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. You can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. You sure? Yeah. Why do I have to watch this? You stay here and watch it, bitch. I'll be here with you. You're a good man. No hesitation whatsoever. That's what I've learned from the show. You've got to give them their choice. Everyone all right? Yeah, we had Travelia some close calls, Hotel. but Glenn is fine. And, well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for you to pick up in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Why? Our friend is still in and out. We won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Mm-hmm. Right then, guys, this has been the end of this episode. Once again, I'm sorry if the audio didn't sound too great from where I'm speaking because my fan is on because it's spoiling in this room. But if you guys have enjoyed, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe if you're new and join the time and I'm today. And also comment your channel name down below in the comments for a chance to be in shout out Sunday. And also I'll have a free spot for Sunday also to do a collab video because Saturday is filled because I'm doing a Gears of War collab with someone. But if you want to collab on any game, just drop me a message down below and I'll check it out and see and I'll get right back to you. So yeah. Also down below will be links for Freedom and Twitter, so find me on Twitter and go and join Freedom for the big Freedom Tree family. So once again, I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you guys later today for a Limbo playthrough. And don't forget to stay starchy. Potato!